The United Nations climate chief has said that governments, business leaders and development and banks have two years to take action in order to avert a far worse climate change. In a speech on Wednesday, Simon Steele warned that global warming is slipping down politicians' agendas. Scientists say reducing climate damaging greenhouse gas emissions by half by 2030 is crucial to stop a rise in temperatures of more than 1.5 Celsius that would unleash more extreme weather and heat. Last year, the world's energy related uh, carbon dioxide emissions increased to a record level. Some of you may think the title of today's event is overly dramatic, melodramatic even. So let me start by explaining why the next two years are so essential in saving the planet. First, we know the stakes. You've heard me talk about um, time and time again, the shattering heat um, and massive damage that climate change is causing to our economies and how there is no room for half measures. Let's take all of that as a given. Second, we are at the start of a race which will determine the biggest winners in a new clean energy economy.